Hello, welcome to a new weekly plan with me. Um, as I discussed in last week's video, uh, I am going to try something a little bit different with this weekly. So what I've done is I looked into how this could be done. I um, printed out two different inserts back to back. So these are both from Peanuts Planner Co. This is DR144, which features on one side this fun little tracker with the blank space, which is fun for decorating. And then this really basic, you know, weekly overview. On the other side, it's got this like hourly tracker thing. And then this more complicated weekly overview with room for like tasks and stuff. I decided I liked this and I liked this. So I just printed them back to back and now I'll show you how I'm going to cut them out and see if this works. Unfortunately, half of this paper is going to end up wasted, but that's just what we do, I guess. We'll see if I really, really like this, then I will stick with it for a little while. So, just lining up with the cut marks. I did a whole video talking about how I cut these before. Uh, it should be up here if you can find it. If I can find it. All right, so I don't need this one or this one. But then these ones, that's correct. Back to back, only the parts that I want. So let's keep that again with this half. Cut them all at once. Discard the halves we don't need. And we're just left with, I'm going to say, my ideal weekly. I have no idea. I like both of these halves. Um, I don't know really how well they're going to work out together, but we're going to figure it out. Oh, that's a little bit tight. That's a shame. short. I might have. Uh, yeah, wasn't paying attention. I cut this one a quarter inch too short, so I'm wasting even more paper. Oh well. I want this to be three and a quarter inches wide and four and three quarter inches tall. There we go. All right. So we now have three of these. Just need a hole punch. All set. And so, got here my ideal weekly layout that I'm going to try for a few weeks. On side A is 144 and on the side is 81. So there you go. And I'll be able to use like these sections for either meal planning or for events or maybe events, probably meal planning here. Um, this will be like tasks towards a focus goal, I think. And then this will be just a list of tasks. Um, and then this is either tracker stuff or tasks will see. This is going to be fun, but that's actually not what I'm going to be doing today because as I explained last week, there's a transition period. So last week I was on this weekly using this freebie weekly and that's printed back to back with itself. So I don't have DR144 on this side. So this week is going to be freebie weekly and DR81 right side. Um, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward through all this and all the decor and population and then I will um, come back and show you uh, when I've got it done.
I usually pick my color themes based on like one inspiring piece of washi tape so I went with this one this week I haven't used it in a while I think it's pretty um, and just sort of picked my shades of blue around that I was trying to go with the more muted shades um, like I have more blues than just these three but these three kind of are on the same um, you know what I mean like it's not too bright not too saturation uh, as well as the mild liner, which I always love to use. So I've got on this side is events. Basically, we have the one thing we do every Tuesday evening, and then Saturday is going to be pretty busy. Other than that, as you can tell, things are pretty wide open, which is great. Um, what that means is that I can fill out my to-do list with a lot more stuff that I can get done in the evenings, maybe. Um, instead of being out and about. We usually have Bible study on Wednesdays, but we wrapped that up last week. And so now everything is just, it just feels like our weeks are a little bit more free. Also, my husband used to have confirmation on Tuesdays, but now he doesn't. So he can come to the story time at the library with us. It's just, it's, it feels nice to be in the summer. And these light shades of blue are making me feel good too. It's uh, not too busy, crazy as far as decor or as far as our schedule goes, and I'm liking the way this is looking for now. Um, I'll probably go ahead and post a, um, you know what, I'm going to do that, and now I'm going to remind myself to post this spread on Instagram on Thursday so that you can see how it's looking. Um, so as you're seeing this now, go ahead and head over to my Instagram, ganchi underscore, and you will see what this has looked like a little bit lived in through the week. Uh, until then, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one. So don't forget to subscribe. Bye!